Hello Collective, welcome back to the Ascended Divination Priestess channel. You are greatly appreciated. Please remember to like, comment, share, subscribe to the YouTube channel. I am sending you all lots of love, joy, peace, and happiness. Many, many blessings to you and your families as always. I return to source, I return to sender, all negative energies and intent immediately and permanently. I call in only the purest of white light and pray that you stay only in the highest of vibrational energies. Whatever the enemy has stolen from you, it is returned to you. All evil and negative plans and intent of the enemies against you are dismantled and being dismantled as we speak. As I have said, so shall it be. Judgment is final. Let's go ahead and get into the terror reading. Um, quickly, there is someone in a community. You're about to be paying some type of lifelong debt to someone. I don't know if there's a woman or a man out here that has been stealing some type of intellectual property or trying to steal what belongs to someone else. Uh, you could be planning on doing something else to further your agenda. You're about to end up in some type of debt. Um, kind of think of, I don't know if a lot of people know this, but P. Diddy, there's a guy that he went and sampled, sampled like a song from someone. Uh, they said, what's the song? Like every, every move you make, that song, P. Diddy, I think he sampled that from someone and he, to this day, has to pay that man like $2,000 a day for the rest of his life. So someone you're about to find yourself in some type of sticky situation like that for stealing from someone. Um, I think there has been someone out here stealing people's work, people's creativity and getting away with, with it for a long time. But it's about to catch up to you. The universe is stepping in to balance something out. Um, I think when you started doing something, you thought it was funny. Uh, you felt entitled to it. You're from some type. Of, you are from some type of community where you all have like a bigotry mindset. You think you're better than other people. You look down on people, but the people you're looking down on are the very people that you are stealing from. So I don't even understand the hypocrisy in that. Um, but just know that you're about to be having to pay people for what it is you stole from them. And I'm talking a whole lot of money, something for life. Okay. All right, so we have to truth being exposed out here by some type of path or choice a Queen of Cups may have taken to work with us, either a Sagittarius or whoever um, behind the scenes. They may have taken some type of action to work with a group of people to temper with someone's investment. Um, I really don't want to focus on these people's negativity because it seems like they've been kind of taking over the reeds for the past few weeks, a um, couple of months, actually, to be honest. Um, but what I'm going to do tonight is focus on you collective so that you know what it is that's up ahead of you. And I just want you all to rest assured that whatever your enemies are plotting against you behind the scenes is not going to be coming into fruition. The universe is dismantling a community, one karmic at a time behind the scenes. And this is by means of the universe choosing and deciding to bring balance into a situation. This is how it was always destined to be. I think uh, for a long time, a group may have felt entitled and was getting some type of humor out of blocking people, you know, going against a lot of light workers out here. This is not just one person. So uh, the universe wants you all to know that you all have new beginnings coming in. You have some type of divine intervention is taking place as clarity being burnt into you all situation some type of tower yeah revelation taking place um in your stories your situation so that you all can take that new path new offers new direction so that you can move on with your life someone may have went to like an elder in their community maybe they went to like a lawyer as well to seek some type of advice some type of clarity and they told them that they need more than likely need to move on and if they've been trying to block you, take something from you, they're telling them that they need to move on with their life because you're someone that's supported by the universe and you are free to uh, do what it is that you want. There is some type of tower going on, though, in a community because of the investments that they put into taking someone's down, someone down. It's like they didn't want you to be seen, but here you are being seen. And you're going seen. You're going from being hidden as the hermit, as far as the hermit, hermit right here, right? Excuse me, as far as the hermit. 
because the hermit has to do with introspection and kind of keeping to yourself so that you can go within and find the answers. It also has to do with you being kind of uh, a, a bit of a recluse, okay, hitting a little bit, but then you go to being, you know, the sun, being out here in the public, bold and outwitted, living in your truth. So whatever work it is you've been committing yourself to, your life, your skills, your path, your healing, You've invested a lot of time into it. You're very passionate about what it is that you do. And this is leading to your success, your victory, your pathway being clear. You may have had a good queen of wands behind the scenes going up against you, trying to prove that she was a better option than you. A sister is going through some type of tower because you will be receiving some type of communication. You will be go uh, going through some type of growth growth sprouts when it comes to whatever whatever it is you've been working on whether this is a nine to five whether it's a business platform whatever it is you're about to be going through some type of growth what they've been doing out here is causing towers every time you're supposed to you know maybe even receive a promotion go viral something like that they've been doing this to a lot of people out here so it's not just one person but there's a queen of wands out here that's been the head honcho when it comes to this situation and more than likely this is the person that's about to be in some type of lifelong death just rest assured that you will have victory and your victory is going to lead to someone living in some type of uh scarcity because someone is about to be facing a lot of legal issues because the court system is going to be balancing something out uh, they're going to be giving what belongs to a high priestess right you may end up in some type of union some type of collaboration um, that's going to be moving for helping you move forward and balancing life out for you but there is some type of karma playing out um, if you don't know I know sometimes when things are going on in our lives we'll th feel like the universe is not moving on our behalf but they really are they're balancing things out you are you there's something where it's like they want you to go from this healing energy to this chaotic energy they want you to go backwards in life basically because the eight of swords has to do with people that are still living in the past but you are someone that's forward moving you may be kind of a little bit uh you know futuristic and maybe people that are coming after you all don't know uh kind of had to get there they don't kind of resonate on their frequency quite yet so they think it's their purpose to take you all down to dismantle your foundations and things like that um all of this is going to be brought to a halt because there's there is in a lot of situations there's either someone that's very upright someone with integrity that's stepping in to balance the situation out um and then in other situations it's the universe just saying you know what we're done with this nonsense it's time to clear to clarify everything expose the truth for what it is uh someone may be out here living in regret because they went up against an actual queen of cups um it's almost as though someone had a fake and uh genuine in front of them and they've been going up against the genuine uh by working with with the full okay uh the fake one um but all of this is being brought to an end there are people behind the scenes that are ab absolutely pissed off that you are having your wish fulfillment that you are being seen or being heard or this is what's coming up for you the ancestors are protecting what it is that's yours everything is being secure you may be having someone coming towards you that's going through some type of laws be very careful this could be like a king of pentacles in the world in, in the reverse that's in his knight of wands energy may want to come to your home to cause you problems there's going to be some type of legal issues he's going to face he may not be aware that he's being watched the, the legal system could be watching someone because they've been carrying something out for a long time i'm telling you the, you see that right there this whole group they're plotting your ending and your ancestors are plotting theirs is that okay an eye for an eye because the universe we live in is very much that mindset okay what you take from someone you lose okay what you do to someone they do to you so while this group is plotting your ending the universe is plotting theirs as well okay so rest assured whatever action these people are uh planning on taking because they are plotting a tower i don't and this is what they do they do things behind the scenes and they try to make it look like it's natural disasters it's not natural if there's somebody's hand in there that's doing something it's not natural uh exactly it is not natural this is something they're plotting and planning because there's someone that wants to come towards you and give you give to you or work with you so that you can move forward they may even want to commit to you or something like that give you some type of position 
there's an emperor in the reverse that's trying to hold on to some type of position within an institution he's not even fit for don't know what he's doing whatever it is um but you're he's gonna have to find the strength to move on just because just like you find the strength to maintain this energy about yourself the queen of pentacles kind of energy there's a queen of pentacles or a queen of wands within a community that's a uh, institute uh i don't want to say the actual word on it on here and this is going to be revealed uh to the community what this woman does behind the scenes for money someone is financially motivated they may, they're not even like a real queen of pentacles this is someone that carries themselves as a queen of pentacles but there's nothing but conflict that comes to this person yeah everyone is about to be starting from one in this situation the universe is stepping in like i said it's a source one, the universe is stepping in to balance something out. There's some type of divine intervention going on. While they want to call it a natural disaster, the universe is saying, you know what? We'll actually put our hand in this so it can actually be a natural, natural disaster for you also. Since you don't want someone to be supported. You don't want someone to be seen. You don't want someone to be taken seriously. You don't want someone having finance, finances or stability or anything like that. We're going to take all of that from you. So while this group is, again, out here plotting an ending for you, wanting you to be on a live or taken out of here the universe is plotting the same thing for them and say you know what an eye for an eye a tooth for a tooth so what you take is what you look what you will lose so the universe i'm telling you is stepping in to balance this sucker out there is some going to be some type of six of pentacles offer i don't know if it's going to come from someone in this institution it could be someone else um but something will be given to you that's going to enable you to move on with your life or balance some type of situation out and it's by ways of your ancestors or the angels the heavenly realms there's a queen of Think a source in a situation that may be going through some type of healing, choosing to balance something out. Uh, this could be like a, I don't know if this is like an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy with that temperance being out here. But someone is going through some type of healing and wanting to balance things out, leaving a, a community, uh, kind of hoping to come towards you to speak their truth, bring clarity. Maybe you and someone are going to sit to have some type of long conversation um, that's going to help you to move on with your life because right now there's some type of energy where it's like there's just too much karma going on behind the scenes someone may be trying to even hide the kind of karma they're going through but the, yeah they're trying to hide it they're trying to hide the end of a relationship they're trying to hide the end of a collaboration because as you can see these people even though they're plotting your ending they themselves they're going through some type of karma and the karma is so heavy they may be trying to hide it this friendship may even be over um for what from what i'm hearing like something is about to be brand new it's like something old is ending and something new is beginning there's a woman out here or a man out here that's been pretending from what i'm hearing to be very gifted to be someone's twin flame to be someone's equal and all of that is being exposed someone is nothing but a joke in the universe or the justice system maybe you know stepping in to balance these people out because these are people that are in some form of old magic being tempering with a high pre uh high priestess yeah high priestess star c energy and they're not getting what it is they want this family it is the end of the road for them they may be throwing some type of temper tantrum behind the scenes because things are not going their way it never was meant to go their way i keep hearing the universe is saying we have been setting up situations for these people to fail and they never knew it. So it's like the universe basically setting like a booby trap and people stepping right into it and thinking that they're going to have victory or something like that. Okay. You as the queen of wands collective in the upright, you are moving forward. Whereas whoever has been pretending to be you, uh, is going through legal issues or is about to go through some type of legal issues. Someone's someone feels that she has to win by all means possible she says she don't care what she has to do to win and this is what's going to lead to her downfall someone is a cool full-blown narcissist they go to practitioners to come up with plans on how they can put an end to your fulfillment this is a narcissist and she's very determined to block communications between two people and to make your life as difficult as possible but whatever it is she's doing is still leading to disappointment for she and the institution that she's been working with they're still out here confused conflicted can figure out how it is you're staying in this energy still have options out here because what they feel is that they've done everything to block your options out here people should not be wanting to work with you you should not have any options coming in but you're you're successfully ending this karmic 
chapter that these people created and you are having a brand new beginning, right? That's going to be very fulfilling. You have achieved some type of status spiritually that other people uh, are still working on achieving and your ancestors are applauding you for doing this and you're about to have some type of new beginning. Could be with a king of pentacles in the upright. May want to share with you, have some type of family dynamic with you, whatever that is. Um, but there are people behind the scenes trying to cause some type of difficulty for an empress energy, maybe even trying to end you and your growth and your abundance and uh, block some type of communication. Maybe I had taken some type of reckless actions that's going to do nothing but backfire and trap them in some type of situation because these people don't know the truth is being looked into. Uh, someone is investigating something behind the scenes, investigating a plot, investigating everything these people have been doing. And this is leading to some type of conflict because they wholeheartedly choose. These people were aware of what they were participating in. They choose to do whatever it is they did so that they could have victory, but they're not having any victory because there's someone that's doing the right thing behind the scenes and this is leading to a tower this will be your ancestor stepping in through the act of someone um and making sure that what is yours is given to you or that you are protected and safe okay these people may be living in fear but still uh doing rituals out here to keep what does not belong to them and the longer they hold on to what does not belong to them the more problems they're having because what you are still going to be fulfilled in life. You're still going to be content. You still have options coming towards you. There's nothing it is they can really do at this point because they don't understand that they're not really coming up against a person or coming up against the universe. Okay. We have a few major arcanas out here. We have the higher fin, the temperance. Uh, we have the hermit. We have the, uh, uh, the judgment card out here, the sun. Yeah. It's the universe all over this situation. So these people are not really going, um, uh, going against a person um, at this point or one being they're going up against the entire universe and they want the universe is making a loud clear and bold statement that we are returning energy that you are sending out there so it's their return to sender except the universe is what is who is doing the return to sender and it's hitting the target right on the mark okay so let's go ahead and see what other details we have in here Someone, could, someone has been working with their ancestors is what I'm hearing as well. Uh, your ancestors are seeing the fact that you've committed yourself. Uh, your endurance, yeah, your endurance, your strength is what has led to the defeat of your enemies because there's something where they've been wanting you to quit what it is you're doing and this is what they've been doing to a lot of like workers behind the scenes. They've been wanting you all to quit your destiny, your, your, your pathway, your commitments and things like that. They don't want you all being committed but you stay committed to your your path fulfilling your contracts and things of that nature and this is why your ancestors are stepping in and saying okay it's time to give them options uh it's time to give them the offers and things like that that belongs to them there is a pentacles all right so they can get away from this weird situation that these people don't know how to let go of so that they can take charge of their life and balance this sucker out get into which fulfillment have their ultimate fulfillment that they've always want it or that we promise them because they've done the work someone is about to connect with their actual emperor your emperor may find you to be someone very, very beautiful i don't know if you know who your emperor is if you are a feminine energy um but there's someone that watches you or someone that's around you or is going to be around you that finds you to be very beautiful loves your energy wants to move on to calmer waters with you and heal things pour into you have that reciprocity kind of situation with you but he's worried that he's going to lose this situation because what or this relationship because there's something this man needs to confess to you and he may be coming towards you deciding to be practical and things like that i think there's a man that fears that he's lost a relationship with someone because he may have taken some type of impulsive action behind the scenes yeah he wants to come together with you uh, build successfully with you yeah he wants to come together with you i threw the dice it came on the two and then the two of cups comes out um but this man wants to build with you but there's some type of confession <laughs> that needs to take place what was that con is that someone doesn't want it to come out he's very burdened it came out the same again he's very burdened worried that he's lost his connection with you this is your emperor 
finding you to be very charismatic, very beautiful, someone very uh, easy to work with, or someone that is more beneficial to work with than to be against. So he may be choosing to move on to karma waters, finding his strength to heal, uh, finding his strength to contact you, communicate with you, send you a message, whatever it is. But it's going to, uh, yeah, he wants to have closure with you, okay? May want to communicate that maybe he made a mistake going up against you. Maybe they've been trying to block your creativity, your work, your dreams, and all of that, trying to get you to not be focused on what it is that matters to you. Because some of these people come from some type of forced religious background. Ground. These are people that pretend to be religious in the public, but behind the scenes, they're into all kinds of situations and things of that nature. Meanwhile, the universe is exposing the truth that you are actually the one that's in the upright. You are the one with the connection to the source. They're over here with the whole ten of pen, ten of swords under them, and you're over here with the higher fin in the upright. Okay. So the universe is making a bold statement. It say, uh, yeah, I don't know who you've been serving, but it hit it in us. I'm telling you, we don't know who you've been serving, but people that serve us genuinely don't move the way you do. They don't try to cause natural disasters to other people because what well, the truth is being exposed and you are set on destroying your your pathway and you think you're about to destroy other people's what destinies and their options and keep them way down and burdened so you can keep stealing from them it's a no-go there's a tower that's about to take place in these people's lives when they choose to do some type of tower uh create some type of tower in your life because there's either like a I don't know if there's like a king of or source in our community that's planning on stealing something from someone. Uh, so if you have some type of promotion, some type of money that's coming in that you're waiting on uh, due to all of your hard work, he's planning on going into a system to block you from receiving that financial payout. This is what he's planning behind the scenes. So just be very cautious. This is someone that's been invading people's privacy for a long time. He's into computers, phones, emails, anything you can think of, maybe anything you can think of there's someone that's in it doing something so he's planning he's waiting for the right time on when he can go into the system to block some type of financial payout i'm telling you he's waiting to block some type of financial payout from going to someone and the moment he does that it's gonna backfire horribly this is a narcissist this is someone that just refuses to grow the heck up someone missed the maturity train a long time ago and they're stuck uh in some type of boyish i don't know what kind of energy that is i don't want to even look into it it's not something that resonates with my soul because it is it's giving me clown it's a lot of arguments and fights going on behind the scenes because of a decision these people made yeah and the universe is kicking ASS and taking names behind the scenes. I'm telling you, because you things are being balanced out. And this is what's pissing these people off, that you are going to be receiving what it is they've been trying to destroy. And that is your commitment, your bounty. Maybe you're supposed to be, maybe some of you are supposed to be with a king of cups and they don't want you with a king of cups because he sees you as someone that's very practical. There are a few women within a family or a community that are about to be going through some type of tower. A queen of swords is about to be homeless. A queen of pentacles is going to be exposed for being an institute. Uh, a whole lot. I don't know if people are not aware of what this woman does for money, but she's been pretending to be wholesome the whole time. Everything is going to be exposed. Just like these people have been out here trying to expose light workers, this is what's about to happen to them. The universe is the one doing the exposure. Okay, it said, oh, you want to tell secrets? You know we know everybody's secrets, right? You know we know your secrets, right? Okay, okay. <laughs> It's time to put this sucker to an end so we can have our star seeds step into their new beginning and go through their rebirth okay? and balance things out, connect with the right people to have their new uh, beginning successfully. Okay, and you all can stay out here confused, angry, bitter in your old mindset about two people coming together because this is what this has to do with two people coming together, two people from different sides of the spectrums two different sides of the track they say you two should not be together one of you may be white or other may be black one of you may be mexican or other be asian they say you two should not be mixing together because these are bigots okay in a community that can't uh especially the, the woman that has been the head of the grab your pitchforks squad this is a bigot 
that thinks that she's better than everybody else and is going to have to move on because this group here is bringing nothing but conflict to her because they're tired of her nonsense. Uh, some of them, but there are those in the community that still want to keep going because they're full of so much hate. These are people that project onto other people. They don't mind doing that as long as it makes them look good. Something very superficial they've had going on for a long time is over. Conflict behind the scenes. Uh, a lot of narcissism, narcissism going on, a lot of uh, arguing, crying, fighting. Someone may be sick behind the scenes, a lot of disappointment, some type of just emotional outburst. Someone is about to have some type of emotional outburst out here. Someone has been abusing their power, all kinds of stuff to make something go, something go their way, just coming up with different ways. Someone says she does not have nothing to lose at this point because she's busted. It's like the truth is out. She can't pretend to be what she's not anymore. So she's just out here just taking a whack at it. Is this going to work? No. Psh, whack at it. Is this going to work? No. Psh, whack at it. It. okay she's gonna keep doing it and it's gonna keep causing more conflict these people are arguing because two people are still coming together still will be healing you could have a king of wands going through some type of healing behind the scenes uh, or you could have a king of wands that's going towards an emperor to come up with some type of proposal on how they can cause someone a loss it's someone out here that just refuses to heal they may want to come into your energy and give you some type of false energy i mean false offer excuse me definitely must be a false energy because that stuff keeps coming out and i'm telling you the universe is the one's balancing something out they may have exposed something to a court official about the truth of a matter who a queen of swords i mean a, yeah queen of swords queen of clubs queen of wands queen of pentacles is so basically an empress who an empress actually is and who something actually belongs to so if there's a court case that's been going on people have been doing things so that you don't receive the information about this court case so then you don't so then you don't show up where you're supposed to be and it has the courts conflicted or something of that nature they're like well you said this belongs to you jesse bell but it looks like this person is the authentic creator of it how are you saying that this belongs belongs to you because Jesse Bell don't want to enforce documents and things like that um, and they're trying to get the court to do things in their favor maybe someone was successful with getting something to be given to them in the past but it's been taken from them if this had to do with some type of some type of fun finances is being blocked from Jesse Bell she don't have access it access to it anymore if this is a relationship someone is not with Jesse Bell anymore She's going to have to move on because this is someone that comes with nothing but conflict. She may be trying to come towards your, your location, whatever this is, and it's going to backfire horribly. They're trying to put an end to two people meeting. So they may be trying to take someone out, but you two are still going to meet because as I said, why do, why are these people applauding your demise? Your ancestors, the universe are plotting theirs. They already have theirs figured out. It's like the moment someone or a group decides to do something, it's the end for them. So they may want uh, to throw with caution because whatever meeting this is or coming together this is that they are trying to block is destined to be. And they're going to be pissing the universe off if they do any type of witchcraft, voodoo, manipulations to end something. They, they don't want from, uh, 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 what is this? Plotting on one person or plotting on both people. And this is where the universe is stepping in with karma, okay? And they're revealing, they're communicating with a high priestess to let them know, hey, whatever it is we promised you, you're still going to be receiving what it is we promised you. You just keep learning and manifesting and moving forward. Trust us, okay? Just like you always have. We'll never lie to you, okay? Uh, someone may be connecting or getting in a partnership, whether it's work or love with a king of pentacles. Uh, be careful as well as there's a king of pentacles out here that does a lot of manipulations behind the scenes. Someone has been trying to hold on to something that does not belong to them. Someone does not want you to be seen. Someone does not want you to be respected. Someone is in some type of silent competition with you. Um, just like a feminine energy is in competition with you. You have a lot of people at your neck, but also know that you have the universe on your side so you've already won the bot <laughs> you've already won the battle you are friends with the i'm telling you baby girl baby boy you are friends with the universe all these sentient beings they're watching over you you have beings from other dimensions watching over you your ancestors watching over you so baby the universe is telling you you just think about it and let us know what it is that you want and baby you'll have it in a hot flash on time Okay?
on time, on site. Okay. With that said, thank you for watching. Stay blessed. I'll see you in my next read. Goodbye for now.